What's up guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you the new Apple TV Streamline interface. Now this is the software update 5.0 for the Apple TV. And basically this, uh, they announced this today alongside with the new Apple TV, the third generation Apple TV. This is basically the new interface that you're going to get for all new Apple TVs they sell. Um, looks pretty good actually, it's a lot better than the previous version. So this is actually my first time using it as well, so let's go ahead and go through it. Let's start with movies. And it looks like the menu is now on the top over there. And this looks really cool, guys. I like it a lot. Um, also, I looked at the Apple TV 3 on their website. It's going to remain on their $99 price point. Pretty good price. But there is no new processor inside, so it is still the A5 chip. There's no A5X. But um, let's go ahead and look at a movie here. And this looks familiar. This looks the same as uh, the old interface. And all right, so along the top here, we can see all this uh, top movies, genius, genres, search, trailers, all this cool stuff along the top. And let's go ahead and hit menu on the remote. And let's go to TV shows. Probably looks the same. Yep, this looks exactly the same. So this is basically the interface we're going to be seeing for um, all the iTunes content. And now Apple, um, the Apple TV supports 1080p quality uh, with iTunes and iTunes in the cloud. And let's go ahead and see music. iTunes match. Okay, I don't have that, so let's not go look at that. All right, so here's settings. See if settings looks any different. Uh, not really. There's just less options, it looks like. Let's go into general. And everything here looks the same. So no differences there in settings. Just a streamlined interface here on the uh, beginning here. Let's go ahead and look at Netflix. Accessing Netflix. See if the interface here is new as well. And it looks like the interface is exactly the same. Alright, so it looks like these little squares for um, all the movies and TV shows are a little bit smaller, a little bit easier to find all of them. Uh, that's pretty cool. So that's Netflix. I'm sure it's the same for all the other TV shows. And um, I'm sure it's the same for YouTube and NBA and all that stuff and trailers. Um, so basically the new interface is going to look like this when you open up and start your new Apple TV. Or if you have the Apple TV 2, this is what it's going to look like. Um, basically, they only updated their apps so um, movies, TV shows, music, and probably computers, If but we couldn't get into those. So guys, that is the new look at the Apple TV interface uh, version 5.0. Again, you can download this for free on your Apple TV 2, or if you buy a new Apple TV 3, this will come pre-installed. I hope you enjoyed this video, guys, and I will see you in the next one.